All right, let's check out the Ranting Rail Fan channel because I haven't checked it in about two weeks. Oh shit! Hello everybody, welcome back to another video on the Ranting Rail Fan channel. The response on that first video far exceeded my expectations for the first video on a channel I just started. So I really appreciate that, thank you. And I saw in the comments of that video someone suggested to do the freight companies of the of North America, so that'll be coming next. But before then, I wanted to try out a new video idea. This is called Dumb Shit That Foamers Do. I hope you enjoy it. So the first picture on the first episode of Dumb Shit That Foamers Do, we have the rail fan making a YouTube video title of me making general signals type 1, 2, and 3 bell sounds. Now, if this kid or this channel looks familiar, maybe you already know who he is. And if I tell you this next quick thing that I'm going to tell you, you're going to definitely know who he is. This is the kid in Garrett's in South Dakota that flipped the mainline uh, BNSF switch. So there you go. Here is a video of me turning the signal to yellow. Here we go. We've all seen enough. Next! The second photo that'll make this dumbass list that I made is from the Norfolk Southern Past and Present Facebook group. And this guy says these different numbers, Norfolk Southern Engine, stores in Atloon, Pennsylvania. So you're telling me this man can't spell stored or Altoona, but he can spell Pennsylvania. <laughs> Oh, this is some stupid shit. Number three is gonna give me a disease reading this, but I have to do it anyway. It's for content. Holy Hogwarts, I spy a great ghost at Preston. Arru! I made up that voice. I don't know what this guy actually sounds like, but I'm hoping that was pretty accurate. The next one is Discord. So that's kind of all I have to say, but I'm going to say more anyway. Uh, this I don't really know the context to this, but I do know that he, he can't say the proof is up your ass. That's what I'm able to figure out. So that there you go. I, I thought this one was funny. And, and the way he actually ends up saying up your ass is he uses the at and two dollar signs. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this is going to give me a brain aneurysm. Oh, the next one's another stroke from the Train Enthusiast Railfan Train Buff Facebook group. Oh my god. What Norfolk Southern heritage until have beat California? Do you are have an English? <laughs> this next one is actually kind of disturbing. Uh, this is an Instagram page of this person from Chicago. I'm just going to read their bio and you can... Make the rest of the judgments for yourself. 36-year-old multi-ethnic female from Chicago, Illinois, USA, in a happy spiritual in a happy spiritual marriage to locomotive METX 210. METX is Metro Commuter Rail in Chicago, by the way. <laughs> and the next absolute gem is from our friend Elliot Walcott. You you know the guy, the foamer from Marion, Ohio. <laughs> Anyway, this is going to be one of those ones where I'm going to regret reading this because this is um, awful. This this sucks. Hi, everyone. I'm looking for some social groups in Columbus, Ohio that has pretty girls that are my age in it. And the reason why I'm looking for some social groups in Columbus, Ohio that has pretty girls that are my age in it because I want the pretty girl in the social group to meet my girlfriend. And me and my mom found a few social groups in Columbus, Ohio that is good for me and they have pretty girls and they are my age. Jesus Christ. That are my age in it but i want to know if there are more social groups in columbus ohio that has pretty girls that are my age in it so everyone if you know some social groups in columbus ohio that has pretty girls that are my age in it please let me know and thank you <sighs> oh i don't even need to say anything the jokes write themselves all right the next one is gonna be another stroke for me <laughs> Oh, uh, this one's amazing. This guy took a photo of uh, BNSF 6017, which is one of those BNSF engines that has the previous uh, logos of the companies that BNSF has absorbed over the years. And 
This guy comments. Are they ever going Clarn the Griffy off it? <laughs> Are they ever going to clean the Peter Griffin off it? <laughs> now, the last one here is working. We're going out with a bang. This one is from o Iowa Railroads, and it's an open letter, so no envelope needed, guys. We're, we're saving the world. No trees slaughtered in the making of this letter. Open letter to anti-passenger service. You don't care because you don't pay one cent. Conservative Scrooge. <laughs> what the fuck does that even mean? You don't care about people. We need passenger service for travel anywhere so we can go anywhere, not just California Zephyr. You hear that, guys? You're bad because you don't want passenger service, you <clears throat> conservative Scrooge. <laughs> Thank you for watching this slightly longer video than the first Ranting Real Fan video. That's just because there was more to talk about here, so, you know, naturally it's longer. I appreciate the, uh, the subscribers and the views for on the first video, because that, um, that kind of made, like, Nagasaki in 1945 and kind of blew up. Uh, <laughs> I shouldn't have said that. Anyways, I will see you in the next video, which will hopefully be all the freight railroads in North America in 10 words or less. Although I do want to pass out one little question to you guys. Should I split it up in class 1s, 2s, and maybe even 3s? Because I know there's a, there's a lot of class 2s and 3s, so it'd be hard to mention every single one. Um, should I go just class 1s? Should I, you know, maybe sprinkle in some bigger class 2s in there? I don't know. You, you can tell me what you think would be best in the comments. Thank you for watching this video. I've been the Renting Ralph, and I'll see you later.